When you comment, it makes my channel, my teaching, better. Everything that you do, regardless if it's a super positive, I like you, if it's like, hey, why don't you do this better? Or even if it's a sort of no, I wish you didn't do that or did it differently. It makes this channel better. So I want to thank you for commenting. I love when you guys comment. Most of the time I will say thank you and I will have a conversation. That's what this is about. This is a social media platform. And I hope that all of us can engage more, not only making this channel better, but giving me ideas on what you guys want to hear. For instance, I have some new songs coming up, some pop songs and some classical songs. And you're going to find throughout this year, I'm going to not only continue to provide you the tips, tricks, and techniques that I've learned of teaching the cello and playing the cello, but also I'll do more pop covers. I'll do more classical music covers and more duets that you can play on SoundCloud and also you can download the partitions on MuseScore. So go on MuseScore. A lot of the scores that I do are uploaded there and you can download and edit them to your heart's content. So go right ahead and have fun on MuseScore and go to SoundCloud. I usually upload three, if not four, depending on how many parts are in the original recording. The first is the original recording, the same exact one that you hear on YouTube, while the other tracks have one piece removed so you can play along. And so when you do this, you're able to play along to the exact songs that you hear me upload here on YouTube. I do it for you guys and I hope you use it more because that's what I love doing here. I love not only teaching cello, but sharing music. And that's why I'm using the different platforms. I'm also very happy to say that not only am I using SoundCloud and MuseScore, but I'm now using Skype as well to teach lessons. I think it works perfectly when you have a good connection and a good microphone. So if you want to have yours truly help you out, even if it's just a single hour a month, or even every once in a while, or you have questions that you would like to directly ask me, what you see here is what you will get in your Skype lesson. Streamed in HD with well-lit, microphones and everything. On my side, I have fiber optic and, well, as you see, nice cameras. So if you're interested in maybe pursuing a Skype lesson, why don't you get in contact with me through my website and we can discuss the particulars. I'm centrally located here in Europe and so time zones are really of no concern to me. I've been doing this for 20 years and I would like to do it for at least another 20 sharing with you the secrets, the tips, the techniques, the things that people pay thousands of dollars for. You can call me a sort of Robin Hood of classical music technique. There's a lot of it out there and there's, I'm being pulled in different directions by different requests from different countries and I'm going to address all of them in the near future, which is great because I get to learn different schools of learning from different areas of the world. So that's fantastic, not only for you guys, but for me. I'm exposed to different ways of learning to teach the bow, control the bow. So those are all comments from you guys. Thanks for doing that. Keep commenting, keep subscribing, keep sharing. And if I talk too much, I'll talk less. I try my best to give you quality content on a regular basis. I do my best to take this very complicated and disparate world of cello technique from various parts of the globe and distill it into seven to nine minute videos that you can enjoy at your leisure. It is quite a tall order to do so. To give you an example, to make one video, the prelude video, the recording of it was quite easy. I was kind of stressing about the positioning and for those of you that said it's a well, it's kind of a plain performance. I meant for it to be very basic. Allow me to share with you the fact that that video series, the three videos that came after to teach it, took me 36 hours of work of editing. I just want to give you an idea of how much time it takes for me to create some of these videos. The teaching videos are by far the most time consuming. And that is why there is not many teachers 
who are sharing the techniques of cello on YouTube. I go very deep into the quality. I spent years as a golden ear of Dolby, so I'm very sensitive to the sounds, to what you are hearing in your headphones. So I try to make it as pleasant and as smooth as possible. And it's all because of you. You give me the fuel to keep on going, regardless if it's another subscription or maybe a like, or maybe a share, or simply a comment, or even a financial donation. Regardless of what it is, I'm very grateful. So thank you. Let's keep pushing. Let's go keep growing together. And I hope we all stick around, enjoy, share with each other, and learn cello.